smell you later, Ashy boy. I'm gonna be going to Alola region to do some research. What's going on, guys? My name is Derby Pearly, and welcome back to another Pokemon discussion video, guys. Today, I'm going to be discussing to you guys can Gary Oak make a return to Alola? Well, guys, we're about to go into depth on why he should or why he can. So, guys, as I always say in my other videos, let's play that special little intro now. Rolling! Okay, guys, we're back, guys. So, today, we're going to be discussing Gary's return. Now, why should Gary return, Pearly? Well, guys, why wouldn't it be cool for Gary to return? One, this man is a researcher now, okay? He, he decided, you know what, Ash, I decided to, you know, I'm going to become a professor. I'm going to become a researcher just like my grandfather. And you know what? I'm going to be the best like no one ever was. And you know what? That's cool and all. Yeah, that, that would be cool to see Gary to go to Alola to do some research on legendary Pokemons and other rare Pokemon. But the real question is, will he still have his great skills that he had in Kanto when he faced Ash in the Kanto League? Now, I'm just thinking about it. Now, wouldn't it be lit if Gary and Ash had a one showdown just for old time sakes? Like, wouldn't that just be so lit? Because we would honestly see Gary's new type of Pokemon. Because we, we did get to see him in Sinnoh when he was trying to help Riolu out. Now, this man had an Electivire. And that Electivire was strong. Stronger than Paul's, that's a fact. Because Gary's been doing this way longer than Paul. Now, Gary Oak, a guy who knows his Pokemon. A guy who knows how to get chicks, get banged, get freaking kids no he doesn't have kids guys but anyways he knows how to he knows how to work his way around regions okay and you know what thinking about that would honestly get me thinking now somebody brought this up saying wouldn't it be cool for gary oak to go to the aether foundation and do some research there now i know this sounds like oh my gosh gary oak is gonna become a pokemon ranger um well guys that could be kind of cool and you know what that's actually a good idea and a question do they have pokemon rangers in alola but that's not what this theory video is about it's about gary now gary could go to the aether foundation and try to do some research on all the mythical beasts that he's heard about through his other uncle slash grandfather or his uncle grandpa whatever the sh you want to call him he just heard those mysteries and he's trying to unlock the secrets about them now why did, would he go to the Aether Foundation? Because that freaking grandpa of his probably told them that they were doing research about it. And then Gary's like, all right, bet. And then he's just going to go over, find some research. He's going to be like, hey, we're doing this to save the world. But, you know, Gary's kind of not stupid. So he could also be infiltrating the base at the same time. It's kind of like a double agent type shit, dude. And you know what? That would honestly be pretty cool because Ash would be like, Gary, why are you doing this? Don't you know that they're bad people? They're trying to hurt all our Pokemon. And Gary's going to be like, bitch, sit down. I know what I'm doing. I like the buyer. Brick, brick his ass. And Ash is going to be like, you know what, Gary? I'm tired of you and I'm tired of you always saying smell you later, Ashy. So, you obviously, Ash is going to use the Z move. And Gary's going to be like, oh, that's cool, fam. Protect. <laughs> Protect. But, oh, I just, mm, I, ooh, dude. I, the, the amount of ideas that could follow up for Gary making a return in Alola, like, it would honestly make sense right here because... He is a researcher, like I said before. He would honestly probably go there more or less just to go research, not to freaking go battle Ash because as he also stated before, he's done with being a Pokemon master. He wants to follow his dream. He wants to pursue of being a Pokemon researcher, just like Professor Oak. And you know what? That's actually pretty cool because considering how Gary knows his Pokemon, just because Professor Oak ta taught him about it and everything, it actually kind of makes sense for him to like go to different regions and you know just research different type of Pokemon but at the same time if they really wanted to do that they could honestly bring back some of Ash's old rivals as well like freaking Paul the best rival there was brother freaking Paul gave Ash the works dude and you know what a lot of people say dude 
Paul was trash. And you know what? He was trash because of his attitude. But he damn well sure had a great ass team that gave Ash the works. But then, you know, being main character and all, he had plot armor and so Ash had to beat him. But anyways, if you guys think Gary would make a great return, let me know what you guys think. Because you know what? I really think that Gary can make a return to Alola. One, he would honestly get a Z move. I know this kid is going to get a Z move. If he does come to Alola, he's going to get a Z move. He's going to get the electric Z move for his Electivire. You know what? Or it could be a fighting Z move for Brick Brick. And you know what? That, that shit's going to be OP. That shit's going to be OP. The dude has raised that Electivire. Ever since he was a kid, dude! I honestly just want to see Gary come back, even though I really, really, really dislike when people say, Gary can give Ash the worst now, boy! <laughs> no, he can't. Freaking bring back Ash Greninja, let's see what that boy has to offer then. Shit, you little bitch. Anyways, guys. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to slam that like button and subscribe button, guys. It really helps get out the video, and as always, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll be sure to catch all you derps and derp bets in the next video, guys. Peace! I'm so glad that I met you. Without you by my side, I wouldn't be here today. Let's keep all our memories close inside of our pockets. We'll keep all of them safe. Hold my hand and never let me go Even when times are hard, I'll still be with you And no matter how old we become I know I'll see you again someday